getting they're getting handled. Got a lot of work to do. That was two years ago. Last season, things were a bit different for the Spartans. Well, Matt Zamparini's got to be pleased with what he has seen. What a great adjustment. We're ahead of where we've been and encouraged by that. Matt Zepparini's men ended four and six in 2010 and were one game shy of the playoffs. Double down, but double down. This year, they are section two contenders. We always want high expectations and I think we've always put high expectations on ourselves and we want to do the work to achieve those. Step and rip across that block. We, uh, we're excited to get this year underway just because our 0 and 10 actually helped us out for this year. We have a lot of returning three-year starters. One of those returning is starting quarterback John Armbrust. Armbrust rolling, getting pressure from Kurtz, goes down field, caught touchdown. He threw for 11 touchdowns and over 1,000 yards last season, rushing for just under 500. And Armbrust is poised for a big senior year. He's um, very good at making good reads. Uh, awesome to have him back there. Oh, he's looking great, throwing and running the ball. You never know what's going to happen on a play. You never know if you're going to run, pass, pull it. You never know what's going to happen. Offense is looking well. Hellbacks are coming along. Offensive line is is uh, playing very well so we again very encouraged with uh, progress there give us the highs and he is in for the touchdown bad news for the offense though fresh off his breakout season Adam Haas will not be hitting the gridiron this season with a torn ACL but plenty of good news in New Holland with an experienced defense and a bunch of experienced wideouts returning the sky is the limit. All right, we just got to stop talking about it and go do it. The Spartans will let the football do all the talking on September 2nd against Twin Valley. Jackie Franchuli, News 11 Sports.